China has been trying to intimidate its adversaries by displaying new weapons in parades or through well-curated videos shared through government-controlled media. But now it seems a rival has taken a page out of its book. In a rare show of strength, the Taiwanese Air Force has released a set of images from its highly reinforced underground complex linked to the Chaishan Air Force Base. The photos were released on July 26 on the Republic of China Air Force's ROCAF's official Facebook page. They were taken on the second day of Taiwan's Han Kuang exercise, which is conducted annually to test the Taiwanese Armed Forces' combat preparedness and is essentially used to validate tactics that can be used against a Chinese attack. In this video, Defense Updates analyzes how Taiwan has sent a clear message to China by showcasing underground bunkers for American-made F-16V fighters. Let's get into the details. This video is sponsored by the free-to-play military vehicle combat game War Thunder. We talk a lot about military vehicles on this channel, but what about trying them out for yourself? In War Thunder, you can choose from more than 1,200 playable vehicles from the 1930s to the 1990s and go to battle on more than 80 theaters of war. You can fly aircraft, helicopters, drive tanks, and command ships of all types and sizes, which have been carefully recreated from their real-world counterparts. It's available as a free download on PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One with cross-platform support. So grab your friends and give it a try. All viewers of Defense Updates that register using the link in the description below will also get a free premium tank, aircraft, or ship and three days of premium account time as a bonus. In the images, the ROCAF, or Republic of China Air Force, personnel from the 5th Tactical Composite Wing can be seen arming the F-16V with Harpoon anti-ship missiles, AIM-120C Advanced Medium Range Air-to-Air -air Missiles AMRAMs, and the AIM-9LM Sidewinders. ROCAF said in a statement accompanying the photos, the 5th Air Force Tactical Mixed Wing conducted the night potential loading and mounting operation during the Hankwang No. 38 exercise today, 26. ROCAF statement added, After the fighter planes completed the combat mission, they returned to the field to replenish ammunition. The operation enables the fighters to take off immediately and continue to carry out combat missions. Our OCAF statement did not specify the location where photos were taken. As per defense journalist and the author of Modern Taiwanese Air Power, Roy Chu, the images were of Taiwan's Chai Shen underground bunker complex. Chu said in a tweet, Although media visits have been hosted at the Chai Shen facility with no pictures permitted, it is remarkable that the public has finally seen imagery from within after 30 years since it was completed in 1992. He further added that Chai Shan was built by carving out a granite mountain in Hailen, surrounded by the rest of Taiwan's central mountain range, according to Chu. Chu has stated in his book that construction on Chai Shan officially began in 1984 and lasted for eight years, costing around $1 billion. The elaborate structure has multiple levels and very strong entry-exit blast doors. The tunnel complex is said to have space inside for parking, arming and repairing over 200 fighter aircraft. It also has hospitals, command and control C2 infrastructure, and food and fuel supplies for several months. The Chai Shan facility is thought to be a backup to the ROCAF's Air Operations Center, an important tunnel complex also referred to as Toad Mountain by Taiwanese Air Force officers. Both Chai Shen and Shizhishan tunnel complexes are located on Taiwan's east coast, making them a bit less vulnerable to Chinese attack by default compared to the facilities on the western side. The single-engine supersonic multi-role F-16 fighter, originally developed by General Dynamics, which is now Lockheed Martin, 
for the United States Air Force is the mainstay of ROCAF. Taiwan received 150 F-16s in the 1990s. Though initial variants of F-16 have been retired in countries that used to operate them, such as Israel, Egypt, and the US, Taiwan, along with Pakistan and Venezuela, remain its major operators. Taiwan will also receive 66 new American-made F-16 fighter jets in the biggest arms sale to the self-governing island in years. The deal was finalized last year. It will get the latest Block V or Viper variant of the Lockheed Martin built fighter. The deal is around $8 billion and the country is expected to receive them starting in 2023. The F-16V standard has the Northrop Grumman AN-APG-83 Scalable Agile Beam Radar Saber, which is a multi-function active electronically scanned array AESA, radar. Other upgrades include new mission computers, an improved electronic warfare suite, modern avionics, and the ability to integrate precision-guided weapons. The addition of these has made the F-16 a very potent platform even against more recently developed fighters. The older F-16s are also being upgraded to V-Standard domestically as part of the Phoenix Rising program. China has seen a high level of economic growth and with that fund, it's made a lot of progress in military hardware. It spends more than 20 times on defense when compared to Taiwan. Chinese fighters and bombers routinely violate Taiwan's airspace, and this has increased significantly in recent times. F-16 is one of the most successful fighter jets in history. The V variant, armed with missiles like AIM-120 AMRAAM, which is considered to be one of the best air-to-air -air missiles in the world, will be a challenge for any Chinese fighter, including PLAAF's best fighter, the Chengdu J-20. The F-16s can also inflict catastrophic damage to the Chinese naval armada with Harpoon anti-ship missiles. China knows this and has filled its coastlines with missiles that can strike Taiwan's military assets, especially the air bases. Fighter jets are most vulnerable when they're on the ground where they can be easily destroyed with a preemptive strike or prevented from takeoff by damaging the runways. The tunnel complex associated with the Chaishan Air Force Base is part of several underground bunker complexes across Taiwan. These will provide the Taiwanese leadership and the military to operate safely if and when they face Chinese missile attacks and airstrikes. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos like this. Hit the like button if you find the video interesting and kindly provide your feedback in the comment section. This will help us improve.